So I just bought Assassin's Creed Brotherhood a few days ago, right before release, um, and I've been playing around 10 hours of multiplayer so far, and I really enjoy it. So I was actually quite quite annoyed by the fact that um, Steam does not have a shortcut for the multiplayer mode, so you have to go into single player, then choose multiplayer from the menu, which then shuts down the single player and st starts up multiplayer. Um, and if you try to add the game to Steam using the uh, non Steam game, at the uh, yeah the uh, multiplayer executable, it'll still launch single player anyway. So um, in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix that. But first, let me show you how to get rid of the game update launcher or the game launcher um, when you start single player and the you play uh, dialog here, and also the intro movies actually. So um. Anyway, right click the game and then go to properties and click set launch options. And if you've been in multiplayer and you've selected go back to single player, you will have noticed that it actually starts single player again without um, the you play dialogue and without the intro movies. And the reason for that is that when multiplayer shuts down, it starts single player with a parameter that tells single player not to. You know, show those things. So um, we're going to start single player with the, with that parameter, which is slash, and then um, launched from other exec. And this will actually work. That's actually enough. But if you just start the game with this, because you've not gone through the login pr procedure of the uplay dialog, um, you will not be locked into uplay. And to fix this, we're going to add a few more parameters. The first is username, then colon, come on, colon, then your username, and then a new parameter, password, and then your password, and OK. And if you launch the game now, it'll skip the Uplay dialog and go directly into the game. Um, you can't see this because the record I'm using can't record in game, but uh, it works. So anyway, let's set the multiplayer executable to the Steam games list. So go to add a game, add a non-Steam game, go to browse, um, select the multiplayer executable, and then add it. And then right click it, properties, um, then rename the shortcut to whatever you like. Assassin's Creed Brotherhood Multiplayer and then go to the target text box, go to the end and we're going to type the same, the same command, the same parameter launched slash launched from other exec launched from other exec, okay um, and this will actually make the multiplayer go into multiplayer rather than start single player um, and now if you start the game, the multiplayer game with this, just this parameter, you will have to enter your username and password when you get into the game. So if you want to automatically log in, um, you just have to append a few more parameters. And the first one is um, not username like the single player executable, but online user, colon, um, your username, then a new parameter slash online password and then your password and close and that's it now you've got a fully working um, shortcut to multiplayer and let's just test so yeah I get directly into the game so um yeah thank you for watching and um, see you later bye